Good day, boys and girls. Welcome to today's maths lesson. Our topic for today is fraction of a whole number. Let's begin. Fraction of a whole number. We first need to know what a fraction is. A fraction is part of a whole. A fraction is made up of a top number and a bottom number. The top number is the numerator. A numerator is the number of parts we have. In this case, our fraction is half, 1 over 2. Our numerator is 1. The denominator is the number of parts the whole is divided into. And in this case, our denominator is 2. Now, how do we remember this, boys and girls? Let me give you a tip. D for down and D for denominator. Let's look at this example. A pizza is sliced into equal pieces. Let's look at the first pizza. The first pizza is sliced into two equal parts. One part is called one half or one over two. Both pieces are half plus half will equal to one whole pizza. Now let's look at the second pizza. The second pizza is cut into eight equal parts. One part is called one eighth or one over eight. And one eighth plus 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 one eighth is equal to one whole. So eight eighths equal to one whole. Now we are going to find out how to find fraction of a whole number. The rule is the whole number must be divided by the denominator. You get an answer. The answer is multiplied by the numerator to give you the answer to the fraction of a whole number. Let's look at this example. 3 fifths of 20 is equal to 12. But how do we get 12, boys and girls? We take the whole number and divide it by the denominator, which is 5, and you get an answer of 4. The answer of 4 is multiplied by the numerator, which is 3, and you get the answer to the fraction of the whole number, which is 12. Learning about fractions was such great fun. Thank you.